38, Brian Gumbel, and one of the great Golden Girls. All right, Willard. Well, Golden Girls is a new NBC television series which airs on Saturday nights, 9 o'clock Eastern Time. The critics have raved about it, and the audience seems to agree. The series stars Rue McClanahan, Betty White, and B. Arthur. Here's a brief look at the three ladies who are three of the four Golden Girls. Honey, are you all right? I'll be fine. Is this about Arnie? No, Blanche. She's upset because they keep changing the taste of Coke. <laughs> And B. Arthur joins us this morning. We should add that the fourth Golden Girl, Estelle Geddes, just wasn't in that clip. Good seeing you. Right. Thank you Thank for being you. here. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Is that premature when I say that? What, congratulations? Yeah. Uh, so far, you're in... you're okay. I mean, I guess we'll know in a couple of... Uh, a couple more weeks if uh, the momentum continues. It's just been incredible. Well, I was going to say, the praise has been, has been so loud and so unanimous. Do you... That it's you, scary. Well, I was going to say, do you yeah. kind of wish it wasn't? Yes. Well, we, you know, the hype was uh, enormous even before we were seen. And we were all afraid, you know, that if you wait long enough and you hear enough about how wonderful something is, by the time you get around to see it, you say, well, I don't know. I don't know. It's good, but it's not that good. But uh, uh, I don't know. So far, so far, everybody loves it. Having said that, just between you and me and yeah. a few million and folks, Willard. Yeah. how good is it? I think it's I think it's one of the best shows I have ever seen in terms of the writing in terms of the casting it's just a joy to go to work every day and I think that's very unusual in so-called sitcoms yeah. you are Dorothy that's right on on this is is Dorothy a lot different than than, than, Maude? than Maude that we came to know and love I don't know about that Brian look I'm a, I'm a tall lady with a deep voice and uh, Maud had been written for me. It was not as though the, the, the thing had been written and then they searched for an actress to play it. So that, of course, there is a similarity. Sure. You know, I, I will never play Juliet. <laughs> and I have seen you quoted that you don't, you don't, you don't mind the similarity. I mean, that this is what works, this is good, yeah. and you're very proud yeah. of it. I, I think it's very bad for actors to start worrying about uh, being typecast. I couldn't agree with you more. Let's, take, really let's take a look at Dorothy in action from okay. uh, a clip from Golden Girls. The show is funny. You know, Barry was the man I wanted to be the first. The first where? <laughs> On Mars, Rose. My first lover. Well, what happened? What happened? Stanley happened. Stanley and I went to a drive-in. He said he was being shipped off to Korea and probably would die and, and it would mean so much. So that was my war effort. <laughs> it took three seconds. I wasn't really sure we had done anything until nine months later when the baby arrived. And I figured that we had, but that was my only proof. <laughs> I waited till my wedding night. <laughs> it, 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 has, it has been noted that yeah. this series flies in the face of all the formulas for, for television success in, in who its stars are and what its material is. Are you talking about age yeah. again? Well, everybody keeps on everybody keeps on throwing age at us and telling us that where you have to hit is 18 to 40, yeah. 18, yeah. what is it, 49? I don't know Something because like I'm beyond that. I really well, don't I mean, know. Uh, I don't even know what the word demographics means. I keep, I keep hearing that all the time. I think the success of the show is simply due to the fact that it's funny and bright and witty and wonderful. And I don't think, it, uh, I don't think uh, the age group matters at all. I think we could be babies or we could be where we are now. I really do. Are you a ratings watcher, a warrior? No, because I don't understand them. I still don't know what share means. Married, you, to, married to Sonny. No, no, you, I mean, your shares, I oh, should yeah, say. I know what you mean. Yeah. No, I don't know. I think it's wonderful. The first week we were number one, we beat Cosby. The second week we were number two, he came in first. I don't really care. The thing that, the thing that I, I love is knowing that I don't have to hide my head and, and pretend that the show isn't going to be seen at 9 o'clock on Saturday night. Mm -hmm. I just think it's wonderful. I don't think you have any worries in that regard. One final note. I saw a quote from you. I will note Vintage 75 that said you're basically shy and don't enjoy things like That's this. Right. That's still true? 
Well, I tell you, I had the most interesting thing happen after 13 years. I did a Tonight Show with Joan Rivers, and I actually relaxed. Really? So I'm quite relaxed now. Oh. But it's taken 13 years. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Success has come to you for a second time. We yes, should note in yes. a sitcom. Saturday nights, 9 o'clock, Golden Girls. B. Arthur, it is a pleasure. Thank Let you very know. much, Brian. 844. Here's the man you gave the plug to. Willard's guy. Checks in the mail. We'll be back after this message from Safeguard, the combination of unbeatable deodorant soap protection and a rich, thick lather.